What's good? What's good? Welcome back to Invest and Trade with Jackson. I'm having a lot of issues with my Mac today. It keeps crashing. I might have to buy a new one or get it looked at. Um, but we're going to go over Bitcoin. Good early afternoon from Johannesburg. Hope everybody's doing well. We're sitting at 31,645. We're up 5.6 on the day. Nice little pump here. We're sitting at a market cap of 598 billion. 24 hour volume, 28.77 billion. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to crypto.com, you can sign up to the world's fastest growing crypto app. Grab one of their incredible Visa cards for cashback and crypto free Spotify, Netflix Prime. Travel incentives, $25 just for signing up through my referral. So we're here on the four hour time frame. We're still range bound in between about 28.6. And 31.4 to about 32.3K. So we can easily, once again, just consolidate and then come back down. But if we were able to finally break this resistance, that's when you're going to see that push up to about 33 to 34K. Now, it does still look like we're going through a WXY zigzag correction pattern. And within each wave is an ABC. So we've come up ABC, ABC. And we may be going through that final ABC that brings us up to 33 to 34K where we've come up. We've created A. B and we're looking for that five wave structure to bring us up to that 33 to 34k level as you can see we put in a nice little ABC correction and we're starting to bounce back so if we do come up and break this resistance that's when you could see that five wave structure to complete the C leg as well as completing the larger wave Y now if we were to break those levels of resistance you could push all the way up to 37.2 to 38.8k and that would basically invalidate this wave four and this may be the bottom for BTC but I wouldn't get too excited till this resistance in between 33.7 and 34.7 is broken and we push and we break above 37.2 and if we break above the swing low which is the bottom of wave one it would invalidate this structure and this would most likely be the bottom for BTC and we once again see continuation of the bull run I do think the more likely scenario is either we get rejected here we consolidate once again we come back down or we push up to 33 to 34k we get rejected and then we come down to the 22 to 24 k price target but i could be wrong if we were to push all the way up to 37 to 38 k then i'd be more convinced that this is our bottom for btc and we're looking for continuation of the bull market i do think this is a massive phase of accumulation i have been accumulating with my altcoins matic uh gala sand mana i've been loading up on metaverse so i definitely think it's a great time to dca into your positions not financial advice of course because i'm not your financial advisor i'm just a young guy from canada so here on the weekly chart we still have the 200 week moving average coming in at that 22k level and the one reason we may not come all the way down to 22k is we haven't had these blow off tops these explosive moves to the upside before crashing down into the bear market like we did in our previous two bull runs as the market matures maybe we won't see as much of this crazy price action where we just absolutely explode and then crash all the way down to the 200 week moving average which is currently coming in at about 22k for bitcoin um, our indicators have come back down to the bottom we'll just quickly pop open the rsi as well on the weekly here hope everybody's doing well and hope you're working towards all your goals and aspirations so as i mentioned i do think the rsi still has a little bit more room to come down towards oversold which it came down to in each and every bear market all the way down to about 30 and we're not quite there yet so that could be another sign that we are going to come down to 22k nobody can tell you for sure what's going to happen that's why i think dollar cost averaging really is the best way to go for your long-term positions as well as your dollar cost average trades so if we're able to come up and break this high at about 31.9 32k that's when we could see that wave c taking us all the way up to 33 to 34k and complete this wxy pattern have a larger corrective wave four before seeing that final fall down to 22 to 24k and if we push up to 37.2 or 38.8 then I'd be more convinced that 30K was our bottom and we are going to see that continuation back to the upside. So that is it for this one. Big shout out to the Discord. Over 1,900 members posting chart patterns talking all things crypto. At the $10 membership, you can access my trade signals. Just made some juicy profits here uh, with Matic. We had our entry here was right around. Let me open this up. 0.5953. We hit our first take profit. I took 50% and now I've closed about 75% of my trade as we're very, very close to our second take profit for Matic. So you can access at the $10 membership. And then we have over 1,900 members posting chart patterns, talking all things crypto and the DCA trade strategy fully explained. Very simple, low stress method of trading. Equal amounts at each buy zone brings your average price down halfway each time. The DCA charts for the live trades on the channel and buy and take profit zones if you want to start dollar cost averaging into your altcoin positions that is it for this one if you want to trade with me sign up to bybit and i'll see you in the next video all right much love take care